What's up guys, David Shepard here on the Humble Hot Shot channel. And today, as you can see behind me, we are hauling an old kind of medium duty uh, white truck, white truck company, um, medium duty, I think it's like a five ton truck. So really cool load, kind of interesting, a little bit of a challenge getting it loaded on this PJ Tilt Deck trailer. So I'll show you that, show you how we got it strapped down. But first, I just wanna share a verse of scripture and today we're starting right from the very very beginning with in the beginning God created so that's Genesis chapter 1 verse 1 the first verse in the Bible and it just says in that first part in the beginning God created the heavens and the earth so fundamental truth and just a good reminder that um, you know there's lots of theories of where we came from as a universe and as in our existence as humanity but I know in my heart that it's true that God's word is true, that God created the heavens and the earth. So I want to remind you guys of that. I encourage you to seek for yourself and, you know, challenge everything. Seek and read for yourself. And um, I hope you come to that life-saving truth. So thanks for listening to that. Now I'll give you guys a little closer look at the white. Uh, again, I don't know exactly what model or make this truck is. I know it's a white truck company, five-ton truck. It says, like, white superpower on the front. So pretty cool. I'm not sure the exact year, but give you guys a little bit closer look at the emblems and stuff. And uh, hey, if you know more about these trucks, please comment down below what, what actually this thing is. But just a short haul, and um, I'll show you, as you can see, the dualies are hanging off the side of the deck. We've just got that 85-inch deck width on the low boy tilt PJ. So didn't get the truck perfectly centered but for as far as we we're going that didn't matter and each dually is hanging off there but kind of hard because the truck's a little bit longer couldn't get back to these rear d-rings and pull the way i wanted to so um going from the same attachment point which is not always ideal not what i would like to do but going to a single attachment point pulling back on the front axle on each side and pulling forward kind of going up to the leaf spring perch was the best way or kind of the front eye of the leaf spring to be able to go through here without rubbing the strap on anything so two straps forward two straps back trucks actually believe it or not really not that heavy we've got the doors and stuff on another load so really not much to it it's not that heavy i'd say about 8,000 pounds 8,500 pounds is what it feels like without scaling it but regular car hauler straps rated for more than enough for this truck again two pulling forward two pulling back and then we've got the front tires basically right to the end of the tilt deck so that we're not fighting that weight with this big rear end wanting to cantilever the tilt deck back so we've got that right up to the front of the tilt deck fits on there where the weights kind of nicely over the axles and then we lock the deck in place and there you go go down the road really well um again wasn't going that far with this so wasn't worried about the width or the weight or anything like that and um yeah fit on there no problem we did have to remove the trailer fenders of course um as you can see the front wheels would not have cleared coming past there but they did clear on the inside of the inner sidewall of the trailer tires so just pop those fenders off like I've shown in other videos and then we were able to sneak this thing right in between the trailer tires and right where we wanted it so you can see those lug nuts were just clear in the sidewall of the trailer tire in there when the fenders were off so super cool truck I think it's uh spent its whole life out here in Colorado so relatively rust free for its age and um not exactly sure the model again but you can see white superpower kind of hood emblem and then it says it again here white superpower so super cool let me know your thoughts and um there you have it five ton truck behind a 2500 dodge ram coming to pick up so thanks for watching everybody comment down below if you like the truck look for more loads coming and god bless each and every one of you see you in the next one